Hey, hello there, Virgo. I'm so happy to have you here for your tarot card prediction. This is a weekly reading, and it covers June 2nd to June 9th, 2018. It is a general reading, so please only take what resonates with you. I can answer your specific questions when you book a reading, following the links in the description box below. If you would like to win a free reading, please press the notification bell, comment, and you will be notified for when you win. I have blessed and meditated and shuffled these cards just for you, Virgo. Your first card, that's the background, the general atmosphere. It's the basis of the matter, and oh boy, it's the sun. Number 19 of the Raider White deck in the Major Arcana. Number 19, the sun, optimism, and joy, and clarity, and attainment and liberation. And this also stands for a marriage card. It's fulfillment. It's success for the future. It's radiance and letting your light shine. It's contentment and joy and freedom. It's enthusiasm and playfulness. It's a card of light. And you're going to benefit from sharing your true thoughts with someone. And the outcome is yes. There is a gift from spirit, and it's going to unfold naturally. Your second card, that's the immediate influence. It's what's occurring now, or crossing over your path. And that's the Empress card of the Major Arcana. Number three, the Empress. And that's fertility. And that's also another marriage card. That's fruitfulness and material abundance. It's fertility for would-be parents. It's love through compassion and nurturing. It's passion. It's health in your home and a need to focus on your family. It could be the birth of a new idea or an energy. It's both financial and emotional support. This empress works for harmony. She could be a mother or a female authority. Your third card, and this is how it affects you, and that is the Ace of Wands. The Ace of Wands. You might as well say ignition, because you're ready to go with positive new, gro new growth. It's the beginning of an enterprise, some kind of business or arts or finance. It's something that you have high passion for. It can be a high passion in a relationship. It's being open for the new, and it's a way out of hard times. It's that spark of inspiration, a gift from life. It's such a great positive new beginning. It's that seed. It's passion and excitement and fun, and it's seize the day. Your fourth card, it's the outcome, it's the future, it's the results, it's the advice and how to respond. It's the Three of Pentacles. The Three of Pentacles. And that's craftsmanship and support from teamwork. And there's people that are around you that want to help you and teach you a better way. They're critics, but they're not bad critics. So listen to them. And it's about people that are coming together to make something happen. It's a foundation that's being set. You know, the early stages of progress. And it's success through your team effort. And your new project, it's going to bring luck. And you might find out you have some latent talents coming forth. In your fifth card, that's what's unseen or underlying the issue. And that's the Hermit. Number nine of the Major Arcana in the Rider Waite deck. The hermit, that could be a guide figure, someone that lights the way. Could be you want to seek a little solitude so you can maybe study and research something, examining something, investigating. Could be a guide figure. It's a time for patience and things are going to work out quietly. It's searching for truth. And that truth is going to be rewarding. 
it's an indication like a light at the end of the tunnel. It's a guide figure that offers help. And you're moving towards a goal. It could be a time of healing. Someone is offering some wisdom. It's a big devotion that's going to go the long run. But you might feel like isolating yourself and reflecting on your goals. It could be a stands for a Virgo. This is a Virgo card. Thank you so much, Virgo. I have extra gratitude for your subscribe and your comment and your like. I really, really love your comments. Now remember, what goes around comes around. So keep it positive. Love and light. Thank you.